Let's discuss this further now. I'm joined by Dr. Lufuno Sadiki, criminologist at the University of uh, Cape Town. Good morning, Doc, and welcome to the South African Morning. It is indeed a tragedy that yet again we are talking about uh, uh, mass shootings and uh, we are seeing yet again the use of, of guns and mostly, we understand, would have been stolen uh, from civilians, from police, from the security uh, forces. So, I mean, gun violence is on the increase and this new feature of mass shootings does not seem to be going away. We've had several in just two months, Doc. Yes, good morning, and thank you so much for having me. Um, it is really troubling um, to witness the increase in violent crimes in our country, and I think we cannot talk about violent crime without looking at the history of our country. And I know people are tired of talking about the apartheid legacy, but some of the issues that we currently have, especially when it comes to gun violence, as well as the illegal firearms circulating, is definitely shaped by our country's history. Even though it's been 30 years of democracy, um, that gun culture um, that we inherited during the apartheid legacy due to decades of armed conflict as well as struggle is still seen today in terms of the social as well as structural violence that we're actually experiencing. Guns, haven't guns become more available than during apartheid under democracy? I mean, we're seeing more and more seemingly availability of guns ending up in the wrong hands. 